I'm New Jeans Honey and this is the 21 with Gucci. First, I'm gonna show what's in my bag. So once I open my bag, I had there's some questions in there. Question number one. Describe your style in three words. Diversity, how comfortable it feels on me, and also how confident it makes me feel. Ta-da! Ta-da! We have my horse bit purse. It's just really nice to carry around and it looks really pretty as well. I haven't got much though. I've got my hotel key card. So I don't lose it. What makes something timeless would definitely be the kind of mood it portrays, kind of like puts out, and it makes you feel a sort of certain way. I think that's one of the factors that makes things timeless. Pull out something else from my bag. I have, I have a massage ball, and it has a smiley face on it. <laughs> it's something I carry around a lot. My members borrow it a lot as well, because I force them to use it. Next question, what is your hidden talent? Maybe it's rough sketching. When I feel a bit bored or when I see something nice that I'd like to kind of remember, I like sketch it on like a certain piece of paper. If Gucci was a dance move, what would it be? Very like elegant, but like fun. So maybe... <laughs> shoulder taps? That's how I think I would express Gucci through a dance. Some shoulder taps. Next question. What is your favorite Italian word? I really like the word for laugh, Didi. My, my pronunciation is really bad, so I'm really sorry, but Didi. I think it's just really nice, the pronunciation just rolls off your tongue. So I think that's what I brought with me from my primary school Italian classes. <laughs> I have another item to show you. I have a bunny pouch. I got gifted it to one of my friends because um, she thinks I look like a bunny. I have this, but it's like kind of like a flower oil. And then what I do in the morning, or like when I'm just want like a nice scent, I put it on my wrist like this. And then I put it behind my ears as well. And then it goes for maybe a few hours. It's just really nice and light. And I use this instead of perfume, so. And then nail clippers. My members will know how much <laughs> I take a lot of consideration to my cuticles and nails. So I always carry nail clippers around. I have my lucky bunny and I think it's just really cute. It's got like a little chef hat on one ear, so I just carry it with me. It's just nice, good luck. Next question. Why is self-expression important? It's a way to learn about yourself more, especially nowadays, everyone's very into self-expression. So have fun with, I would say, and challenge yourself. I've been trying it and it's very fun. So I recommend it. It's really fun. <laughs> How do you unwind? Actually, recently I got into reading books. I like to just listen to music and sing along. It helps me a lot to learn more about different styles and like how I can express this song. And just hearing a lot of different artists like kind of convey their message through music. I think it's really fun to listen to and connect to. So I listen to a lot of music. Next question. Freestyle your look in five seconds. Five seconds? <laughs> five, four, three, Go. One, I found it. Oh wait, my stylist does a really cool thing where she pins on her hair like this. Oh, there we go. I put it in. It looks really, it's really cool to put pins on your braids. I think it's kind of unique and you can see it well, you know, you gotta show it off. <laughs> Where do you want to travel next? I would love to come to Italy again. I really want to go to Florence though because I heard that's where Gucci started. So definitely have to come back. Last question, my last question. <gasps> Say goodbye in three languages. Okay, here comes my trilingual skills. Goodbye. 안녕하세요. Which means bye in Korean and also in Italian. Arrivederci. Ciao. That's three languages. <laughs> Ciao! <laughs> there we go. We go back to the questions again. Don't go anywhere. Maybe you should stay. Okay. Ooh. Okay, we got it. Next question. 